Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Freddy Welts, channel. Welcome back to another Legacy of Doors DLC video. Today we're taking a look at the Arc 5 Declan vs. Selena or Reggie vs. Serena DLC. Really good DLC, I think. Uh, I think this is one of the better ones. More content than this one than quite a few of the other ones. So, with regards to story mode duels, we have two duels. We have Yuya vs. Declan and Declan vs. Selena. Moving on to duels challenges again. Two challenges, Selena and Declan, respectively. Nothing shocker there. I mean, the, the Dual Monsters ones are pretty shocker because they had a ton of uh, characters rather than just you know the ones that were stayed on the front of the uh, advertisement. Three decks: Zephyr, Lunalites, and DDDs. One thing I'm going to point out before we get into this: Why is Declan the face of the Lunalite deck when it's Selena's archetype? Yeah, I don't know what they were thinking. Anyway, let's go and look at the Zephyrs first. First of all, we have three Oracle of Zephyr. 3 Zephyr Path, 3 Chosen of Zephyr, 3 Zephyr Divine Strike, 1 Ritual Beast Tamer Zephyr and Pilica, uh, 3 Ritual Beast Tamer Zephyr Wendy, 3 Satellan Light Zephyr Thumban, 3 Shadol Zephyr Call, 3 Sh Shadol Zephyr Naga, 3 Stellar Knight Zephyr Exiton, uh, 3 Zephyr Ranyu Zephyr Nui Secret of the Yang Zing, 3 Zephyr Saber Sword Master of the Necros, 3 Zephyr Axa Flame Beast of the Necros, and finally, 3 Zephraxi, Treasure of the Yang Zing. We do have two more copies of Ritual Beast Tamer Zephyr and Pilica in our side deck as well. I, uh, I don't know what to think about Zephyrus, I haven't really played with them before, so it's going to be good to check them out. Next we go to the DDD deck. Of course, this DDD deck is not going to be anywhere near as powerful as it could be because we've not got the support for the 2016 Megatins like uh, Alexander and stuff like that. And we haven't got the uh, Structure Deck content either that's coming out in January uh, in the TCG, so no idea when that's going to be included in the actual game. But here we go anyway. 3 Dark Contract with the Gate, 3 Dark Contract with the Swamp King, three DD, uh, 1 DDD Contract Change, uh, 1 DDD Human Resources, uh, 2 Dark Contract with Errors, 3 Dark Contract with the Witch, 3 DDD Birthmert, 3 DDD Necro Slime, 3 DDD Pandora, uh, 3 DDD Swell Slime, 3 DDD Dragon King Pendragon, uh, 3 DD7 Galilei, uh, 3 DD7 Kepler, 3 DDD Oblivion King Abyss Ragnarok, and 3 DDD Rebel King Leonidas. For our extra deck, we have 3 copies of DDD Oracle King Dark, uh, 3 copies of DDD Wave Oblivion King Caesar Ragnarok, 3 copies of DDD Duo Dawn King Kali Yuga, 3 copies of DDD Marksman King Tell, and 3 copies of DDD Wave King Caesar. Now, for our side deck, we have 3 copies of Contract Laundering. Two more copies of DDD Contract Change, two more copies of DDD Human Resources, and one more copy of Dark Contract with Errors. And finally, moving on to Selena's Lunar Light deck. Again, this isn't going to be as good as it could be because we're missing Lunar Light Perfume, we're missing um, Lunar Light Crimson Fox, which isn't even out in the TCG, and there's a couple of Lunar Lights as well that have been released recently that we are missing, unfortunately. This is going to be good to be able to finally play with Lunar Lights. It's an archetype that I do like quite a lot. So here we go, it's three backup riders. Uh, 3 Castle Call, cool, 3 Fusion Tag, 3 Moon Mirror Shield, 3 Lunalite Reincarnation Dance, 1 Secret Blast, uh, 3 Lunalite Black Sheep, 3 Lunalite Blue Cat, 3 Lunalite Purple Butterfly, 3 Lunalite White Rabbit, 3 Pero Pero Separus, 3 Putrid Pudding Body Buddies, don't know what the hell that is, uh, 3 Lunalite Tiger, and 3 Lunalite Wolf. For our extra deck, we have 3 copies of Lunalite Cat Dancer. 3 copies of Lunalite Leo Dancer and 3 copies of Lunalite Panther Dancer. And finally for the side deck we have 2 copies of Secret Blast. But that is it for this Legacy of the Duelist DLC update video thing. Really good DLC, um, 2 of my favourite characters from Arc 5. Uh, underpowered DDD deck, underpowered Lunalite deck, but again, going to be really awesome to be able to play with them in the game. Will you be picking any of these DLC up? Feel free to let me know in the comments down below. Or just leave a comment in general and leave a like, it really helps the channel out. Feel free to subscribe if you're not subscribed already. If you want to see more of these videos, thanks for watching, and I will see you all in the next Legacy of the Doors video. See you then.